Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy No Life Sim. We back with another video. Now, hold on, hold on. I know what y'all thinking. Samples. Where are the samples? Wednesday. The samples get here Wednesday. I got my um my tracking my tracking number last week. It told me Wednesday. So look forward to Wednesday. Wednesday is gonna be a part two from the first video I made of how to start a clothing brand. Wednesday, the package should come. I'm gonna show y'all the sample and everything. So Wednesday, look forward to Wednesday. Right now is gonna be a um I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to make a mock-up. Basically, what to send to your manufacturer. It's very simple. A lot of people don't know how to do this, but it is very simple. You can come up with your own designs. I'm gonna be teaching y'all exactly how I do it and how I made my first design that y'all seen in um the first video. So first things first, we gotta go to Photo P. We gotta go to Photo P. Um, I also want to thank y'all for giving, giving me that much likes, um, subscribing, all of that. It, it makes me want to record more for y'all. Like I got up and I was like, dang, they're actually really liking that. That last video I dropped, let me let me put out another video. It shows me that y'all really rocking with me. So if y'all rocking with me, I'm rocking with y'all. Let me keep posting videos. Y'all just got to keep liking, subscribing, turn on, the, um, hit that bell so you get notified when I post. All of that. It, it shows me that y'all really, y'all really want to see more of me. All right, Photo P is the first thing y'all want to head to. If y'all don't know what this is, it's just like Photoshop. It's just like Illustrator. Um, y'all know Photoshop and Illustrator you have to pay for. There's ways to get it for free, but I don't recommend it. Um, just use Photo P. It's free and it's online. You don't have to download anything. You know, if you have like a weaker computer or whatever, you don't have to um, download it. So, PhotoP.com, right? <laughs> Click new project. We're going to do 1920 by 1080 and then we're just gonna name it the same date the 14th and we're gonna create it like that all right cool everything good everything all right cool crispy all right so first thing first i was literally about to um make a design last night and i was like nah i'm gonna go to because it was late i was like, i'm gonna go to sleep and then i'm uh i'm gonna record it because some people actually like this experience so my brand name is called absolute value so first thing first you want to go to the text on the left and then you could just click that and place it right make the size a little bit bigger and y'all could just kind of mimic what i'm doing right we're gonna double click this up here is where you can get your fonts right so let me show y'all where to get fonts from uh it's this website called thefont.com y'all could go here right bunch of fonts bunch of fonts all you'd have to do is download it right here as a matter of fact, I'm gonna show y'all. I'm, I'm gonna show y'all. Let's find the font together. I'm gonna walk y'all through everything. Like I'm gonna hold y'all hands a little bit because I know some of y'all really do not know how to do this. So I'm gonna walk y'all through it a little bit. Uh, what font do I like? Let me see. It was a it was a new one that recently came and I had I had got it. I forgot what it was called, but all right. I'm gonna just pick one. I don't really like any of these to be to be honest, but. Okay, this is cool. Artificial intelligence. Download. Boom. Something's gonna pop up by the, at the bottom, right there, right here. Boom. If you have um, WinRAR, you should be straight. Even if you don't, you should still be straight. I'm gonna open. I'm gonna show in folder. Go here. I'm gonna put it in my fonts folder because I like to be a little bit more organized. This is it right here. Artificial artificial intelligence. I'm gonna um, right click it, and then I'm gonna extract here. And then uh, yes to all, boom, it's right here. Artificial intelligence, right? In the fonts folder where I saved it. I'm gonna go back here. Right, I'm gonna show y'all. Go up here, click load font, go to fonts, and then I'm gonna go to, where is it? Artificial intelligence, the one I extracted. It's right here, open, okay. It's gonna say loaded. Now I'm gonna go find it, artificial intelligence right here i'm gonna start so i could um always remember where to find it click it and now when i type this is the one i just downloaded uh so loot value boom that's how you that's how you get new fonts into this y'all see that's how you get new fonts but i'm not gonna be using this font i had a font i downloaded last night oh my gosh it's amazing I'll show y'all right now I'm actually gonna use that font instead. 
uh it's not on this one okay so i'm a load font and then i'm i think it's called storm some yep storm gust is right here open loaded right okay cool now i'm gonna go to it storm it's right here all right so um we're gonna be using this one uh storm gust i really like this one i ain't gonna lie i really like this one i don't know why but this one stuck out to me and we're gonna do it like that boom so first thing first y'all would i would recommend to make like a some type of logo or whatever you think would go nice on the shirt make it here first right so that's what i'm doing right now i'm gonna um make this white and my stroke black yep just like that i'm gonna up the stroke a little bit my fault if y'all don't know how to do this right click to the side click blending options right here and then click a uh, color overlay and stroke so like the cover color overlay is the main color the stroke is like the outline right so i'm gonna make this like i like i like my outlines thick me personally i like my outlines a little thick that's pretty cool i like seven seven's nice boom so we already have the words this alone is already halfway done really now you might want to design i don't know how to design what do i get a design from this is where you get your designs from people aren't telling you all this but this is a good way to get designed. So we got our font from the font.com, right? Go to kittle.com, K-I-T-T-L, right? I'm gonna teach y'all a little trick. Boom. Um, after you sign up or just log in with your Gmail account, click add new um, project, right? In this left tab over here, go to elements and you can go to abstract. Bunch, it's a bunch of different shapes bunch of things you could just drag in and see what you like like y'all know y2k is very very um popular the trend or whatever this is all the things you can get from the y2k um community it's all free on here right now and all we have to do is drag it over there right so this is all of them right here right now so i could just pick one let's say you want like uh this is one i used in the past before right so, but I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, drag a new one to show y'all how to do it. So you can just take this one, right? Uh, I'm gonna enlarge it a little bit. Take it like this, right? You're gonna wanna go to the top right and download it. Download, download this PNG, right? You wanna go to this website right here. Remove dot BG. It stands for background. Remove background, right? Drag what you just downloaded onto the screen onto this website. It's gonna remove the background for you and make it a PNG. So you know when you drag it into here, it won't be with a white background. You need it to be transparent, which is called a um, a PNG or a transparent image. Sorry. So you're gonna download it right here after it transforms into this and remove the background. Then you could just drag it on here, just like that. Just like that. You know what I'm saying? And just to show you guys, I'm gonna make it black. Hold up. See. The background is black now, but the the image is very, very transparent, so it's gonna turn whatever the background is, right? Boom, pretty cool. Yes, so we added our star. Mind you, I'm not a designer. I'm just using the tools that's free and given to me, right? So that's how you would get, um, if you want a cool image, this is where you can get it from. You don't have to be a designer to, oh, how do they make that? No, they just grab transparent images and put it next to their logo, you know what I'm saying? It's simple, but it makes you can make some very cool designs like this. So, let's say if that's too big, I can resize this with um Control Alt and T. I am on Windows. Sorry, my Mac people, I don't know what it is for y'all. It's probably Command. I know y'all have Command on Mac and stuff, but I'm on Windows. So, boom, that's pretty cool. I can resize that. Whatever. We just made us something that could possibly go on a, a hoodie, a T-shirt, whatever. Now, if y'all watched my last video, I told you about Reno Studios. That's where I get my mock-ups from. That's what we're gonna do now. We're gonna place in a mock-up right now. So I'm gonna click open in place. At the top left, file, then go to open in place. I'm gonna go to my mock-ups, which is somewhere in here. It's on my desktop, and then I have my, no, it's in my downloads, sorry. Mock-up PNGs, bundle. We're gonna go to the hoodies, and I'm gonna pick a blank. So I'm gonna go black on this one, because black's simple, a lot of people like black. We're gonna drag this layer down. So it sees everything, boom, just like that. 
and we're gonna have to resize our absolute value just like this resize it boom put that right in the middle just like that if y'all want free mock-ups y'all could go to the brand Bible the brand Bible and just download them they're free if you don't want to pay for a mock-up they're free boom get the star going right here that might be a little bit too high hold on let me drop this down a little bit more like there make the star a tad bit smaller and I'm gonna change the color because I don't want it to be black on black you can also zoom in here a little bit by holding down alt in on the scroll wheel of the mouse then we'll just make this image like that let me take off the stroke how would that look okay that's not bad oh let me see change the stroke a little bit and just like that you can make a hoodie just like that literally literally that simple you can make a hoodie like and this isn't even like special or anything but hold on let me actually put the value on the bottom and see how to look and y'all can play around and actually you know get comfortable on the designs boom we could do it like that we could even do it like this you know what i'm saying even like this or we can make a separate one so we can make the value bigger right like this we're gonna make a separate um text so i can make it closer add the same colors and stroke to it i think i had it on eight something like this or hold on let me see let me see how it would look inverted with the white outline let me see something uh no nah, i like the i like the other way better i like the other way better so a little white on a black outline just like that we're gonna make the absolute bigger and this is the process i go through when i like design like don't don't get it twisted this stuff doesn't take like an hour sometimes you could be here for hours truly getting the design you want because to be creative and actually be different it takes time like i wouldn't recommend copying nobody ever like just hop in here and get comfortable. I showed y'all the layouts. I showed y'all the keys to how you can be creative possibly, right? Uh, if I don't want that there, I could just move it down and put it behind. Uh, it still looks nasty. Let me see. Where would I want this star? I probably wouldn't even use a star for real in this design, to be honest. It could even be here. Or, you know what we could do? We could put it on the hoodie and make it puff print. That'll be really nice. We could put it like in the middle of the hoodie, like that, like something like this. This actually look decent, I'm not gonna lie. This actually looks pretty good. I'm gonna put this a tad bit higher. But yeah, this would be it. Boom, we did that like in 10 minutes. Literally. I showed y'all where to get the font from. I showed y'all where to get the mock-ups from. Go to the brand Bible, just to show y'all. Where is it, it's right here. The brand Bible.us, they have free mock-ups free uh where they where they where they there's somewhere in here hold on uh resources right here mock-ups boom free free you just click open oh they have flares i'm gonna actually take this and make flares <laughs> i'm gonna take this but yeah look free literally hats zip up hoodies anything you need free literally and then you'll drag it in here and voila that easy you can make a mock-up just like this this is what you would send to your manufacturing now if you want me to get a little bit more detail i could make a part two and um i could show y'all exactly like the detail details like tell your tell them you want puff tell them you want this the dimensions you need a size chart that's to be even more specific with your manufacturer which you do want to be as specific as possible because you don't want them to mess up your clothes right but this is exactly how you would make the mock-up I showed y'all where to get designs from right here look all the designs you need a bunch of designs bunch you have paint splatter all of this stuff i'm actually gonna make flares i'm actually gonna make flares and make a video on it y'all let me know if i should do that flares are if y'all don't know what flare pants is these are the sweats right here they're actually very popular now they're going crazy so like some flares look very nice i'm gonna make i'm gonna make my own but that's pretty much the video y'all photo p um to design the font to get your fonts from you can download it for free kittle also for free bunch of designs these are the stuff people aren't telling y'all kittle for free i just show y'all how to remove the background 
you can just insert everything on a photo p and boom you have your mock-up i hope you guys enjoyed it's been your boy no life simi make sure y'all like comment subscribe hit the notification bell to know when i upload look forward to wednesday y'all wednesday i get my samples my first ever samples i get on wednesday um it's gonna go crazy i'm recording it the minute it gets here uh y'all let me know what y'all want to see in the comments i seen somebody also want me to do a heat press video i'm gonna do that i got y'all everything y'all recommend in the comments i'm going to do just let me know what y'all want to see and i'm gonna let y'all know if i can do it it's been your boy in the lower semi and i'm gone